I, I just hung that up, but then I was like, is there a ghost behind me? What's moving? Um, hello. It's Thursday. I only know that because I knew you, I, I had to figure out yesterday was Wednesday. Um, I literally hit record, saw that move, and then saw the baby move. She just woke up from her nap. I'm the only one home. It's 6 p.m. Well, the kids are home, and me and 433 dogs. Oh my gosh. Speaking of a ton of dogs, I think my, my like face unreddening lights back up. He took them down for when his mom came. Okay, I was reading the news today, like whatever just pops up on my phone. And there was an article about this like, like a, like a pet cafe in China where you can go and you can pet dogs and cats and have like a coffee. We have something like that in, up in Salt Lake. They have like a little bakery and you can get your drink and go pet kitties. This one had huskies and someone left the gate open and a hundred huskies got loose in the shopping mall and it was just chaos. It's like how I imagine my, it is my life. I'm just not imagining, except I don't have a food court. That would be awesome. Bazillionaire goals, my own just food food court. Um, but they're, the dogs are just running crazy. And he's schooling Elsie. Mom told you not to do that. Um, hold on, I gotta clean my camera legs. And go save a child. So, it's 6.10 now, and um, I have not started cooking dinner. Josh was literally to the parking lot of Sam's Club because he needed gas and I needed cabbage for tonight. And he got a call out. Hold on, there's, now there's a dog crying. And what extra sucks is that the Sam's is like a half a mile from our house. That's bananas. So, I am... Stretch very. Here. I'm here. I am stretched very thin right now. So I. So somebody, Tammy Frass, Frass, Tammy suggested rice, chicken, apples, and cabbage. I didn't have any cabbage, and Sam's Club doesn't, doesn't have just a head. So for $2, he's grabbing some coleslaw mix. Um, and I did start the rice because, and I have garlic and water. So it, 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 it um, defrosts. But I haven't started doing anything yet. Nana. We don't have any bananas. Sick. And bubbles. And what? Mm -hmm. That's not a banana, that's a carrot. No, 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 don't lean, I'm gonna drop you. <laughs> Elsie, I'm gonna drop you. You're too big. for some flavor and so it doesn't go bad in my fridge I have, I'm not a juggler I have one honey crisp apple and then I got these they're a little wet because I thawed them but I got these at the food pantry I think the last time and they're chicken Denmark chicken green onion garlic sausages put it back in the, in the sink until I take it out So I also pulled out, I have this much onion, I have this little bit of zucchini, I don't know if I'll use it, I just, I try to pull out all the bits and pieces to try to at least add them in. Um, just in some warm water I have the garlic, that's what Elsie was talking about. I thought maybe some leeks, and I have 
this much carrot that I had thrown in. What did I do with that? I peeled it yesterday. Did I use it in the potato salad? Yeah, for the little crunch. My shoulder gets like stuck and I have to pop it and it hurts. Anyways, so that's what I'm thinking. I don't really have a plan yet. Might as well just eat the carrot. I'm tired. During nap, I brought 13 of the dogs in the bed with me so that that way they would be quiet and we just laid there and watched Law and Order. And I took two of them to run in the backyard up the hill. I just don't trust the fences to take everyone by myself. But he's a good listener, so... And Sky's been up there. But anyways, um, I put chicken outside. She can walk like a little bit and then she has to rest, but she's not falling over. I don't know. It's like, and then her wing kind of gets, she's like me, my shoulder. I think this is from like breastfeeding and holding chunky babies. But then she'll have to sit. So I don't know what's going on. Now she's up. I'm watching her. I don't know, poor thing. She doesn't hurt. I touched her everywhere. Anyways, I'm kind of, he, the alert went off that the card was used, so I'm expecting him to walk through the door any minute. But I guess while I'm waiting, will I have a second while she's playing with the little ones? I think. Um, I'm going to cut the onion and the apple, so I'll be right back. He's home. He brought this. I just had him grab this. This is what we're gonna use perfect right it has green cabbage red cabbage and carrot it's just a tricolor coleslaw mix there's no sauce or anything so that's our cabbage right when I started chopping Lucy number three's mom texted that she is on her way to get her my rice is counting down so let's start cooking um he brought me a diet cook they're like 89 cents there I'm spoiled Okay, so down here, I grated all but this much apple and the zucchini, um, just because I'm going to use that for dinner for one of the girls. This is my garlic, onion, and leek. I used about half of half of the onion, and then um, my thought is I'm going to take these sausages out of their casings, but let's get this cooking. Oh, I took everything out but my oil. You dying? It's a pain. Really, really bad. He, our front door, you have to walk up steps, a lot of steps. And it sucks when you have to bring in cat litter and. Ah! Sorry. All the things he just carried in. Thankfully, he's a big, strong, handsome man. Okay. Oil. I'm going to let this heat up to probably garlic powder. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. Let's open this up while that pan gets getting hot. I turn it on like medium. Okay. I really have no idea what I'm going to make here. Get that going, and then, I don't know, how many are in here? 
eight. So I'll do half. I'm just gonna cut the casings off. One of the reasons why I picked this one, even though the uh, spray is in here, here, was because, oh, she chased the cat upstairs, that's why. Um, we had tried some apple sausage and he did not like it at all. And I was like, really? I feel like apple sausage is something that you would like. And he's like, no, we didn't like it. And I was like, I like apple sausage. Maybe not that one. So that's when I read the comment last night. I was like, ooh, that's tomorrow. So I know it's kind of, I kind of cheated, but. Oh, well, right? Sometimes you have to cheat. <laughs> Sometimes when you have 15 dogs, and 202, you just have to cheat. Love it. It's over on the back there. I actually like her. She's the one that's leaving tonight. She's not one of the problem children. She's just fluffy and so sweet. Come here, Lucy three. I call her Lucy because she's kind of blind. Lucy. Oh, Lucy, you have a. Just the girls. So this is Lucy 3. She can't see anything. But she's so very sweet. So sweet. Now I go wash my hands, Lucy number 3. She's 7. Oh, that's a great shot. Um, she's 7 and loves kids. So she's just spent the entire time just sitting by the girls. Elsie was on the trampoline and she tried... Not jumping, she was just sitting on the trampoline or standing. And uh, she went up and had to like sit by her on the trampoline. It was really cute. Lucy number two, I don't think, has had a lot of training. That's why I think they brought her over for us to meet first. And they were like, what do you think? Do you like her? Oh my God. She's crazy with you here. I don't know if she'll be as crazy when you're not here. So I kind of just have like a general idea of what I want to do. I knew that I wanted to do, I think I even commented Gouda in it. I don't have Gouda. But I'm thinking just like this over rice. Simple, nothing crazy. And I get, I've, I've been debating on if I want to do the cabbage cooked or raw. But I'm thinking cooked with some butter would be really good. And I think this is actually going to cook up pretty fast. Let me, oh, my rice has two minutes. I thought it was done. Okay. I don't want to add any spices until I get this chicken cooked because I don't know what it tastes like. I've never had this. It looks like it's from Smith's or Kroger. If that's the main name. It varies. It's like Fred Meyer, Kroger, Smith, whatever. There's a bunch of them. Oh, did I even say anything about me? So many. <laughs> Hello, I'm Laura. You know, Kim from the Wads doesn't always say an introduction. She just dances. Can I just dance instead? But this is Chop Challenge, day nine. Four ingredients were given to me. I didn't 
officially pick one until about three o'clock, which is why I had to thaw the sausage in water. Because I wasn't really sure what I was gonna do. If I was gonna do that or if I was gonna do something else. I was kind of playing with the idea of using the other half of the roast. Mr. Dinky is back to trying to escape again. He keeps sitting at the window. Make sure she hasn't messaged me. Nope. Just breaking this up. You can see little green specks in it, so that must be the green onion. But otherwise, I have no idea what they put in it. trying to read the ingredients. Then I just touched it and got it in there. This is kind of giving off like Asian vibes. Like Asian flavor. will totally change what I do with the bottom. Okay, I'm going to not throw all of this in yet. All the zucchini. Or most of the zucchini. And I'm going to leave some of it just in case I decide to go with a different idea. That apple is very juicy. Sneak out the door. Okay, this is cooked. Let me taste what it tastes like. I don't want any of the apple or anything. Interesting. It's like chicken and just green onion. Like, there's not really many other flavors in that. Give me one second. They're here to get Lucy number three. Okay. So I was thinking maybe of doing like kind of an Asian inspired, but I'm, it's really bland, so we don't have to do that. So let's just add everything in now or add it to the countertop. That also works. Like, it doesn't even really have a very salty flavor. So, 
black or white pepper. I brought that over here. Spice-wise though, I don't know what I want to do. Hmm. The cabbage is going to pick up a lot of it too, but I really feel like the cabbage just in butter. This is like a pretty easy, I've been loving these easy dinners. Poor Amber's gotten the, all the hard stuff. <laughs> and then poor Josh at the end of her last video got handed a plate of ribs and she was like, you can't eat them yet. You got to try the wonton, which was so creative. But you could just see this sadness in his eyes like, oh, I'm so hungry and I just wanted to eat the ribs. Yeah, made me laugh. Okay, we have our basics in. Right. I think I'm gonna just use the buttery garlic and some basil. Because if I cook the kosa in butter, they'll go nice. This is going to be like a super simple bowl. Well, it's hot. I'm sorry, I'm tasting and deciding. Okay, I think with the Parmesan, it'll tie together. It just doesn't have a lot of components that you can see. So I'm like, we need vegetables. I'm like, wait, we have, we're gonna have vegetables. We need, wait, we need, no, we're gonna have that. So, okay. I'm gonna transfer it to a bowl. And then I'm gonna cook the cabbage and then we can put it back in. All right, I have my butter. Dinner will be done in about five minutes. So maybe you should stop meowing and just live your life. He is trying to live his life outside. So I put a little bit of oil outside. The sun is shining outside. Um, somebody's crying. What's wrong with her, Indy? What's, why is she crying? <clears throat> Added some salt and a little bit of extra oil with the butter. We've learned during the cabbage challenge that cabbage needs butter. I mean, cabbage needs salt. Oh my gosh, and yesterday when I was editing my video of doing the uh, macaroni, the potato salad, I did it again. I kept calling it macaroni salad like every other time. I was like, oh my gosh, my brain. But we're going to have dinner. 
think I'm finding <laughs> She has to color in. Dinner's almost done. That would be weird if you just sat there and ignored her request for color. Okay, I'll go get them. I may agree to just sit I'm going to cut this apple for the girl. Today, we're in chit chat for a second. <laughs> well, I cut this. So, today, um, the little one, the littlest, she was eating. I don't know if I got them at a food pantry or if I just got them on clearance at Smith's, but they're like mini Lara bars and they're a chocolate flavor. So, I had gotten it for Elsie. And um, I had it sitting there and Gracie grabs it and eats it. And it just looks like it's just brown smeared everywhere. And there's a little piece that falls off and like the dogs are kind of around. So I pick up the little piece and I put it on Indy's head and I said, oh my gosh, look, somebody just pooped. And she was like, oh my gosh. And she's like flinging her hands and I just laughed hysterically. So that's all the joy I get in my days. No, I have a lot of joy. That's the joy I get with the dogs. I can pull pranks. That's more what I'm like. Oh, look, there's Gustav. Gustav! 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 He's a bad cat. He, um, Indy came in, in the room a couple days ago into the bedroom. Or, yeah, I think I was in there with the little girls doing something. And her face just is like, has stuff all over it. And I'm like, I'm thinking she's doing some kind of weird makeup experiment. And I guess he pulled her cereal bowl and it flew and she just had like cereal that had been sitting for like, she'd already finished. So it was just like the remnants soggy all over her face. And I was, I was trying not to laugh, but I seriously thought she was doing some kind of weird makeup. Anyways, life. Okay. I think that's cooked good enough. Yep. We don't want it soggy. Add this back in. Oh gosh, I'm just making a huge mess. I'm going to turn it down. I'm going to do like a splash of some milk and some of this parm just to give it a little bit of a creamy, creamy, a cream, cream. Some of that. Perfect. And some cheese. I don't, I'm not trying to make like an Alfredo or anything. I just want that milk to kind of help with melting the, um, cheese so that it's not just like cheese meat like it makes kind of a little bit of a sauce yeah. what she dropped her remote on the other side of the oh she when she was crying earlier it was because her remote she was playing with fell on the other side of the the gate and she was very very upset about that it's so funny how she's getting all these feelings not funny, but it's so cute to watch her, like, feelings expand. Okay, let's taste this. Okay. I like it. It gives, like, kind of a... It, like, it kind of gives a little bit of that Alfredo-y taste, but without, like you saw... I still have a ton of the cheese left, 
and I put like a quarter cup of milk in, maybe. But it just kind of makes it a little creamy. But what I'm gonna do, everybody is hungry. It is seven o'clock. I'm gonna throw. This is what dinner looks like. It's it's not very eye pleasing at all. It looks kind of one colorish, but it's because everything I used was pretty much the same color, which was white or gray. Um, it's been like ten minutes since I put this on the plate because we are having a sad moment because we can't color anymore. So I'm gonna have them come and taste this when we can get this. We're on, we're almost calm. I even gave her a root beer. We'll be back. She says she's scared and we can't put her down and she cries. So you'll just have to either trust me or maybe I can record it later how it tastes. But at this moment, that's happening and it comes first. So I'll see you later, best friends, if I do not come back with an extra cup. Good night. This is how we are having dinner tonight. She has a towel on because they don't, they eat without their shirts on. But she likes it. Do you like it? Oh, yeah. Will you give her some so she can... Oh, Gracie, do you like it, Gracie? I can't show you because you don't have a shirt on. <laughs> um, so how would you describe it? It's like salty and sweet, and there's a little kick in the end. So there's apples in it. Mm -hmm. Apple chicken sausage. And that's where the sweet comes from? Uh, yeah, because um, I didn't put anything sweet in it. Mm -hmm. So it has to, and they were really sweet apples or honey crisp. Mm -hmm. And then I put a little bit of milk and some Parmesan to make it like a little creamy. Mm. It's really good. The flavors blend together really well. And Elsie likes it, so that's a win. Mm -hmm. This one had a pizza. She says hi. Because they're a dollar at Sam's. So now I'm going to go eat. Okay, bye.